by Steve Kim Freddie Roach, the current trainer of WBO 154-pound champion, Miguel Cotto, was in attendance at the Tmobile Arena in Las Vegas this past weekend where middleweight king, Janet Golovkin, and Saul Alvarez fought to a controversial draw. Golovkin retained his IBF, WBA, IBO, WBC 160-pound titles when the official judges issued scores of 114,114. 115,113 Golovkin and 118,110 Canelo. Pretty good fight, I had Triple G winning by two points, it was a close fight, the trainer said to BoxingScene.com earlier this week, while back at work at his wild card boxing club in Hollywood, California. It was definitely entertaining. Alvarez moved quite a bit more than I thought he would carrying all that weight. He was in pretty good shape. Fighting for the first time since losing a 12-round decision to Canelo in November 2015, Cotto returned to the ring last month and defeated Yoshihiro Kamigai over 12 rounds at the StubHub Center in Carson, California. Following that win, there was talk of Cotto facing the winner of Canelo versus Golovkin down the line. Cotto is planning to have the final fight of his career on a date in December. The draw verdict, which may result in a rematch next May, was the worst-case scenario for the Puerto Rican star. It is because they'll have to do it again, and everyone has to pretty much wait in line now, conceded Roach. It was a pretty good action fight, and some good punches landed and both seemed to have really good chins. It was entertaining. When asked if it was tough to beat Alvarez on the scorecards in Las Vegas, Roach quipped it's very tough to beat Canelo in the United States. So who does Cotto face next Roach stated. If either one wants to fight us, come on. Steve Kim is the news editor for BoxingScene.com.